Greetings, everyone. This is Dillion Francis sixty here, and I'm giving you my opinion of the new news that we just got from World Fe Peacekeepers. We have a new aircraft and a new vehicle coming soon. But for here, I'm going to show you my short collection because I already have all the main aircraft they have. I recently completed them during the summer. And I already made a review on one of them, the J-10, like a year ago. And you, you may have seen the Su-27 flanker on one of the Cobra conversion um, video that I made for that G.I. Joe. Don't worry, I'll make a review on that aircraft soon. But I'm also working on another, on another aircraft. But this is just a short overview of them. And as you can see, I have some, I'm excited for the new aircraft, whatever it may, may be. So we'll probably add another collection. Also, we can get some added aircraft, like a, another attack jet or another fighter jet. And there are some lists because Human Mechanism released a video like two weeks ago, I believe. And he said he wants... The F-15, and I agree. As you can see, most of this aircraft that I have need some more customization because World Peacekeepers, they're pretty good, but you need to um, added more customization, especially in their pilot department. I hope they fix that. They give us more articulation on the pilot and give us a new sculpt because I really don't want to spend time spend a lot of money on customizing other G.I. Joe figures because um, World Peacekeeper figures, they're pretty um, they're pretty good when you um, customize them. Like, I hope they fix the head so it can actually rotate and the mast, um, the gas mask or something, the gear for the pilot because that's, that's the need to be fixed or else you can just modify them like I did with this, um, these pilots over here using ace and scarlet uh i modified them so i i will put them in the review so i will give you i'm working on a separate review on the f-18 so that's coming soon but right now this is a good collection that i i have this collection right now so i'm pretty excited for the new vehicle and the new fi fighter jets because Upgrading them is fun because I uh, like I see here I added an IR sensor for the um the flanker and I'm gonna be modifying the J10 soon and the A10. All of these aircraft is gonna be modified, so it'll be much better for especially when I'm doing stop motion and stuff. It can be done. It can be done. Now the exciting part, we know that this we're having this um. They have only four, so according to this, they want us to, um, what kind of jet they want to vote it in. I see a list like the F-16, Falcon, the F-35, and the F-15 over here that um, Human Mechanism is actually voting for, and I approve of that. And F-22, I would love to, but I already have that aircraft. Here, here's a photo from the True Heroes or Mortal Max that I made um, last year. Um, I really don't need an F-22 in my arsenal. But I would rather go for more foreign aircraft like the MiG-29, the Fulcrum. So this aircraft will be an interesting addition. And also not just fighter jet, but some attack jets like the Su-25 Russians. So more Russians will be good. I'll be happy to have this um ground attack because we already have three um, two Americans. So and here's another one for the Chinese Air Force. It'll be the Q5 Phantom attack jet. So that will probably um that will probably add up to their um arsenal. So that's another good aircraft to have around. So I would I know there's only one right now, but I would go for the either the F-35 or the F-15 and F-16. But 
foreign aircraft will be nice too. I have some on the list, but we don't really need another F-14. I agree with human mechanism with this one. We don't need this one. Unless you want to uh, make a Iranian F-14 because this aircraft is no longer in the U.S. service. It's only in the Iranian Air Force, so... I think that's my opinion on them. Also, tell me about in the comment if you're finding any world peacekeepers at Big Lots. Because in my current Big Lots, I don't see any world peacekeepers. All I see is a bunch of BBIs now for some reason. So please give me a um, report if in your Big Lots area. Just give me a comment on my on my video. I need to know if they are looking for a new distributor. Now my um my vote for the aircraft of choice. It was a tough one. It took me a couple weeks to choose, but I'm definitely gonna agree with human mechanism. F fifteen. An aircraft that has seen a lot of um battles over the years. It had seen many countries use this aircraft and we still use this. And this is legendary before even the U.S. was able to deploy this in the first Gulf War. From the Israelis to the Saudis to the every country, Japan, Korea has their variation of this aircraft. And even in some fictional universe, yes, if you ever played um, Ace Combat, the Balkan Wars... The two mercenary pilots that you that you're that you play the that you're part of. Yeah, I would choose these guys. Yeah. Gelm team and aka Demon Lord. I would love to um customize that. I'll buy multiple of this aircraft if it's um nominated. And the F with the F fifteen that's a legendary aircraft, so I nominate this aircraft to be the next um, World Peacekeeper toy. We don't know when this is going to come out, so right now I'm going to assume probably around next year or something. It depends how they, how they do it. So another aircraft that is coming out will be, it will be, it'll be awesome. So... Tell me what your opinion on the new aircraft that MNC Toys World Peacekeeper is about to release. And make sure to leave a comment on your opinion and also vote on the aircraft. Now I need to build me an airbase. Oops, Stellion Fan 60 here, signing off.